Cobb County, one of the most populated areas in the metro, now trying to expand their transit system and upgrade what's already in place. Atlanta News First political reporter Doug Reardon is live for us near Smyrna. And Doug, you're being told that the cost for all of this for residents will be low. Yeah, Rick, that is what county commissioners are telling us. A one cent sales tax over 30 years to pay for some really simple improvements. Things like at this bus stop along Concord Road, maybe a bench or some shelter to keep you safe from the heat and the rain and the cold. Uh, but maybe even down the road, talking bigger picture, a partnership with MARTA that has evaded Cobb County for almost 60 years. And there's no shelter, no bench, nothing to wait for your bus that comes hourly sometimes. Matt Stigall is fed up with the state of transit in Cobb County. As he walks us along a treacherous path to a bus stop you can barely see, he reminds us that right now, transportation is the second highest cost to most local families after housing. I want to be able to have transit as an option uh, anywhere I go in the county for whatever reason I have. According to the Cobb County Commission, 80% of their residents who use transit are taking it to work or school. Cobb has its own bus system, opting out of MARTA 60 years ago. But a referendum for a one cent sales tax to fund transit over 30 years could find its way onto the 2024 ballot to fund improvements and possibly that long sought MARTA connection. So what's important to us, not just talking about mobility as a sexy thing, as a new thing, this is an essential thing. Lisa Cupid, chair of the county commission, has heard all the anecdotes. People having to walk one and two miles to be able to get to a bus stop that will take about an hour to get them to their job. This lady came by my office crying because she was in need of medical services and she had to walk over a mile to get to the hospital. Along with more frequent routes, Cupid is hoping voters okay funding in whatever form it comes in for better lighting, sidewalks, shelters, safer intersections, and maybe even a direct mortal line to the city. Matt is hoping for the same. And, uh, and we wonder why people don't take transit sometimes and why ridership's down. And we don't really push it or fund it or support it in ways that we should. Yeah, and opponents of this uh, push to get more improvements in transit, like the Cobb County Taxpayers Association, say that, in their words, they don't want to ruin the urban, uh, suburban feel uh, here in Cobb County. We reached out to them a couple times to see if they wanted to comment for this story. We did not hear back. We're near Smyrna tonight. Doug Reardon, Atlanta News First.